Today on Hands On Wellness, if you're like me, you're probably dealing with interesting allergies and sinus pain right about now. It's that wonderful time of the year. Oh my goodness. Well, I have a nice, interesting bit of tech that may help you out with that. Stay tuned. Hands On Wellness is brought to you from LastPass Studios. Using the same password everywhere is a security nightmare waiting to happen. LastPass easily creates unique passwords for every site. Visit lastpass.com slash twit. This, this is twit. Hey, what's going on, everybody? I am Matt Pruitt, and this is Hands On Wellness here on Twit TV. I hope y'all are doing well. I'm unbelievable as always. Granted, my voice sounds a little bit weird today, but we're just going to push on through, right? Yes, we are. This is the podcast where I like to sit down and share with you different consumer technology and products that are out there available to us that is going to help us get a better grip on our own personal wellness. I mean, these things are just sort of floating around all over the Internet and Amazon. And some of these tools are even in our back pocket and placed on our smartphones. Why not utilize those te- those tools to to get a better grip on our personal wellness? Well, that's what this show is all about. And we're going to talk about another interesting tech device today uh, momentarily. But first, if this is your first time checking out the show, go ahead and hit subscribe in your favorite podcast app of choice, whether it's Spotify or Apple podcast or Google play or what have you, you can find us there as under hands on wellness and just hit subscribe there. Or if you're not able to search for us inside of your app, just go to our website, twit.tv slash how that's twit.tv slash H O W for hands on wellness. And you'll see all of our subscription options available there, including our YouTube channel. I appreciate all the support and I appreciate you all helping to grow the hands on wellness community. So now let's go ahead and get into this week's show. Now, way back on episode 19, I believe, I talked to you all about some technology that can be used for for pain management. Now, I'm a big proponent of not taking painkillers and pain pills and things like that. They are so easily and readily available to most of us out here today. And quite frankly, I don't like the fact that those things could be quite addictive to people, um, nor do I like the fact that it can destroy your liver if you over overdo it. So I don't take pain pills very often. Every now and then I do, but I try my best not to. So that's why I introduced the TENS unit to you all and talked about how it could be used for pain management. Well, similar to that, I have another tool today, and this is from the folks at Tivic Health, and this is the Clear Up from Tivic Health. Now, what the heck is this thing? Uh, Other than it being something that's about the size of a regular uh, chicken egg, it is a device that is used to help you with sinus pressure and sinus pain. Right now, personally, I'm experiencing a little bit of sinus pressure and sinus pain. Uh, As some of you may already know, I am not originally from Northern California. I migrated here, me and my family, from the East Coast in North Carolina. And since moving here, every now and then I have noticed issues with my sinuses based on different allergies and things like that. So right now I'm having lots of pain around this eye right here. Even my voice sounds a little bit different today because the pressure is so, so out of whack in my head and in my sinuses. Well, what can I do about that? Ideally, you want to go and grab yourself some allergy medications or sinus pills and things like that. And yeah, that may work for you. But I like the idea of taking something like this here, clear up from Tivic Health and utilizing it to work out my sinus pressure. So how does this thing work? Let me show you another little view of this. So how does this work? You power it up and you just place place this around the the uh, sinus bones and the 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 eyebrow bones and around your eye socket, around your nose. And this little pulse, this little device will send micro pulses uh, into the nerves in that area to help give you just a little jolt of relief. It's not something that you're going to feel like as in pain or a shock or anything like that. It's really, really, really tiny 
bits of um, electric current that goes through and helps stimulate the nerves in those sinuses to help you feel a little bit more relief. Again, this is about the size of a of a regular chicken egg, and it's rechargeable um, for with a USB-C connection. Typical treatment for one of these things is about five minutes. Uh, as you power it up, you can like I actually demonstrate it now. As you power it up and you place it towards one of your sinus areas, like I'll put it on the side of my nose right now, and the tip will light up green, and you'll see a little green light and it'll start to do a little bit of a pulse and you just hold it there momentarily while it's doing these little tiny micro pulses and it'll stop. That means you need to move it to another area. So what you should do is move it up and around your sinus area. Just use, you know, maybe two inches or so at the most as you move it around and it'll just give you a nice little gentle massage around your, your eyebrows, around the, the outsides of your eye socket, your nose. I've even put it like right here in the middle of my uh, eyebrows at the lower base of my forehead because I have pressure there. And it will work pretty quickly. Uh, Tivic Health says this thing will work typically after about two or three uh, uses. And I found it to be right on par with that. Some people get immediate uh, immediate relief when using it. It didn't work for me right out the gate. It took a couple uses for me to be able to see some relief and feel some relief. You can use this device up to uh, about four times a day if you need to, if you need to. Um, and it's only going to take about five minutes of your time just to navigate around your, your different um pressure points on your face and your sinuses. It's really, really slick. It's really intuitive. And you'll see it gets a little green light right there at the tip and it starts to vibrate. And when it's done, you just move to the next spot. Green light comes on and it vibrates, sending little micro pulses. It's pretty neat. And it's not very loud or makes a whole lot of noise. And it's not a bunch of crazy flashing lights on it to be uh, intrusive or a bit distracting for yourself or anybody else around you. I think this is very, very well done. And again, it's something that's going to help provide some relief that's not forcing you to go and spend money on pain pills or sinus medications and things like that. Now, the main thing about this, the price, what does this cost? You can get the clear up for $149 on the website. We'll have a link in our show notes or in the show description, just in case you're interested in getting your hands on one. $150 may be a little bit steep for some people right now, but my challenge to you is, okay, so let's do some math. If you were to purchase uh, your, rent, your run of the mill, over the counter, sinus pressure, sinus medications, such as, uh, I don't know, what is it? Sudafed and things like that. I think they average out to be about six or seven dollars U.S. per box. And I think there's normally anywhere between 12 to 24 tablets in there. Those are not something that's something that's probably not going to last you for a month, depending on the recommended doses and uses. So six to seven dollars a month, um, six to seven dollars per box. Multiply that by maybe twice a month. That's just a little bit more money. Now multiply that by several times per year. You're still going to be spending a little bit more money than you really need to. And you're dealing with giving more chemicals into your body and just making your liver work a little bit harder than it needs to, in my opinion. So I say look at an option like this. That's not going to use any type of chemicals. It's just going to use a nice massaging microcurrent that is commonly used today by uh, physical therapists as well as massage therapists that like to just help you feel better. Because a lot of times, just think about it. When your head starts to hurt, you the first thing you do is this and you start to rub to try to make yourself feel a little bit better. Well, why not utilize a microcurrent? It's going to get a little bit deeper and it's probably going to work a lot faster. All right. 
So that's going to do it for this week's episode, folks. I thank you all for your continued support of Hands-On Wellness. If you have any other questions, feel free to shoot an email to how at twit.tv. Or if you just want to share some uh, tips and ideas or product recommendations you think I could look into, you can send them on over there as well. Uh, If you have any type of progress on your own personal wellness that you'd like to share with me, I'd love to hear from you regarding that too. So send those over as well, and I'll be more than happy to send a virtual high five your way. All right. Now, also... This is a, a pretty interesting time right now. We're still dealing with the, the wildfires here wildfires here in Northern California. I send all of my thoughts and prayers to those folks that are affected by that and nothing but love and support to our local firefighters here in the area. Thank you all for trying to help keep all of us safe here. And that's another thing that's really screwing with my nose and my eyes because the smoke out there is pretty bad. So thank you to the firefighters out there trying to help keep us safe. All right, folks, y'all continue to safely be well and do well out there. And I'll catch you next time here on Hands on Wellness. And yes, I am still looking for justice for Brianna Taylor. Take care. One more twit? Well, check out Hands on iOS, twit.tv slash HOI, where I teach you all about iPhones, iPads, AirPods, Apple Watches, and so much more. If you want to get the most out of your device, then you got to check out Hands on iOS, twit.tv slash HOI.